Mississippi's trigger law is now certified, and in less than two weeks, the ban on abortion will take effect. Tall News' Tal Tal has reaction from both sides of the abortion debate. Tal? Well, it would just be a matter of days until Mississippi's only abortion clinic, the Pink House, is forced to close its doors, the ban taking effect in 10 days. Just days after the U.S. Supreme Court voted to overturn the landmark Roe v. Wade, Mississippi Attorney General Lynn Fitch on Monday certified the state's trigger law. I wish it was sooner rather than today. Abortion opponents waiting for this day. It's been a long time coming. While abortion rights supporters call it a failure in the highest court. It's ghastly. It's ghastly. But I can't say that, it, you know, we, we all saw it coming, I think. In Jackson, those on both sides of the abortion debate are counting down the days until the state's pink house closes its doors next week. We're praying that women would change their mind and not come at all. Preparing for a post-Roe America. We're going to continue to introduce the legislation that we've been introducing that made sense and continues to make sense. It makes sense to expand Medicaid. It makes sense to carve out in mental health more services for women and children that have been in traumatic situations. Not long after, on Monday, the Jackson Women's Health Organization filing a new lawsuit to prevent the Magnolia State from enforcing its trigger law and Mississippi's six-week ban. And again, the, the ban goes in effect in 10 days, making abortions in Mississippi a felony under certain exceptions to save the mother's life or rape, provided that she has reported the crime to law enforcement. I'm Tao Tao